greetings and welcome to your new video i hope you're all doing well so guys if you want ipad os features right on your iphone on ios you can follow this guide you will get the split view multitasking a floating bar or on your home button devices you will be able to simply slide up from the bottom to go home or to go to the app switcher this will work on ios 15 or higher and it requires a jailbreak so as you can see i am already jailbroken with pale rain root less and i am on ios 16.7.4 on this iphone 8 plus the method shown in this video along with troll pad which we will be using is completely free if you don't know how to get jailbroken the guides are in the description for all your compatible devices and ios versions now first of all open safari and type here troll pad github and you will land at the very first link which is the official github page for troll pad simply open it also if the troll pad gets added into a repo for Celio. I will also mention that in the pinned comment. Now simply scroll down and get to releases. And now simply get the latest release from here. It is a dev file. Simply open it. Just tap on it and then hit download and then simply go to downloads and you'll find it here now simply hit this magnifying button and then simply tap on it and then tap the share button and then share it to seal you all right and now you can simply hit get and install it also to install it you must have alley kit installed if it is not installed it will be installed automatically with trollpad hit confirm and then simply restart springboard your device will respring and when you go in you will notice that the status bar has changed as you can see the wi-fi icon is at the right side now and when i go in you can see i have this floating dock right here and also I have the date and day and time right here and again the Wi-Fi icon is at the right side the only thing not working for me is the control center I cannot call it from anywhere so if it is working for you on your device please write in the comments now as I said if you are using a home button device you don't have to use the home button to get to the app switcher now simply slide and you will get to your app switcher from here you can see we now have the grid app switcher just like we have on ipad os you can simply open an app from here now for example to get multitasking working i have opened the safari now i will simply slide up slowly from the bottom just like that and now for example i want to multitask with messages i will just tap and drag it up and i can put it to the right side or the left side or i can leave it on the windows beneath it and then you can see i have two apps open at the same time and i can interact with them also if i want to close the app for example messages i will simply slide up from the bar and you will get this little handle here just slide it to get to it again also from the dock from right here you can go to your app library just like that also for example i have messages open and i want to go to the split view i will simply tap these three dots and from here i can go to split view slide over or close it so if i tap split view now i will be able to select 
an app for example safari and i will simply change the orientation and from here i can work with two apps on my screen i can interact with them also if you have apps combined for a split view they are right here in the app switcher as you can see it right here i have safari and messages combined if i open it and simply change the orientation i can work with them easily also if you have any app open and you change the orientation now you can simply slide up from the bottom select any app like Celio for example drag it up to the right side or to the left side and leave it here and you can see now we can easily multitask without any issues you can easily slide over in your apps for example I have settings open I will simply hit these three dots and then select slide over and then I will select a new application for example photos all right and then you can see how these apps are slided over and now I can move the app which is on another app also yes if you want to add more icons to your dock you can simply drag any app up to remove it and then you can add your own just like that without any issues and it will work just fine all right guys please experiment with it and please type in the comments to tell me how it goes for you also if you want to get rid of it you can simply open Celio then select or type trollpad hit modify and then confirm and then simply restart the springboard and it will be gone the device will respring and when you are back on it will be back to stock that's all for this video if you still have questions please ask in the comment section and i will reply you as soon as possible i will see you in a new video goodbye and take care of yourself